Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for April 23rd of 2024 is titled Contrail Shadow X. So what do we see here? Well, here we see two contrails and you can see those cloud trails stretching across the sky and intersecting just above the tall building in the foreground. Now these are left behind by airplanes. So as airplanes go through the atmosphere, they can leave water behind. So water droplets that will freeze in the upper atmosphere and that can form clouds. So we can see them here as very bright when illuminated from below. And we know that they're being illuminated from below. First of all, we can see them glowing a brightly bright white color. And we can also see the shadow they are casting on other clouds. So just like this, because they're lit from below, that they will cast shadows just like any other object. Clouds, while not solid, are dense enough to cast a shadow. And here we can see that. We can see how that X-shaped uh, contrails crossing down below up above on the cloud also appears as a large X. And again, that is just the shadows. Those are not gaps in the clouds up above. That's actually the shadows from down below. So the light shining down below there is blocked out by the contrails and casts that shadow, just as any other object would cast a shadow, as we've seen many shadows of the uh, cast by the moon passing in front of the sun recently from the eclipse of a couple of weeks ago. Now normally this shadow would be invisible. You normally would not see this going across the uh, across the sky because if the sky were clear, the shadow would just trail off into the clear atmosphere and you'd never see anything. However, because the cloud cover is there up above, we actually get to see the shadow. So this could happen all the time and you would not even know it if the sky had been more clear. If that cloud, those upper clouds were not present, you would not see this shadow. Now we look at clouds and clouds occur in many places in the solar system. So clouds are not unique to Earth. We see many other planets, especially the large planets that are covered in clouds continuously. And that includes the four large outer planets, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune, and also Venus continually shrouded in clouds. Other objects like our moon and Mercury have no atmosphere and therefore would have no clouds either. And the planet that would have clouds most similar to Earth would be Mars. The other planets that we've talked about here would be constantly shrouded in, cl in clouds. But Mars very rather very rare because Mars has a very thin and very dry atmosphere. They are sometimes visible and you will get sometimes actually clouds on Mars, which is something astronomers are currently studying with the different Mars rovers by watching the atmosphere to see when they develop. So that was our picture of the day for April 23rd of 2024. It was titled Contrail Shadow X. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be a star's art. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.